Hey guys, how you doing? This is Paul, and today I just have a quick video to show you guys the top three ways to increase productivity in Windows 10. So the first one is really simple, and it has to do with this taskbar here at the bottom of the screen. So you'll notice that if I go ahead and open up Google Chrome here, that the taskbar can take up a lot of valuable space there at the bottom and you probably only really use it every once in a while but it takes up this much space all the time. So what I like to do is go ahead and right click on it and then you're going to want to click properties and that brings up this little tab that says taskbar and start menu properties. Then you're going to want to click the little checkbox that says auto hide the taskbar. And what this basically does is it just hides the taskbar when you aren't using it. And from this same tab, I like to choose which side of the screen that the taskbar is on. Uh, my personal favorite is the left side. You can also choose uh, right side, you can keep it on the bottom, or you can even put it on the top of the screen. But like I said, I like left, and then you go ahead and click apply, and then OK. And you'll see now that the taskbar here on the left only shows up when I slide over to the left and it just disappears if I slide to the right. So with this, I can now take advantage of my full screen real estate, which is really useful. Now on to tip number two, you probably knew that in older versions of Windows, you were able to snap uh, applications and windows onto the left and right side of the display like this. But now in Windows 10, you can snap the applications and windows to all four corners of the screen at once. And it's super simple. All you have to do is instead of dragging to the edge of the screen, you go ahead and drag into the corner and it automatically snaps into place. There's also a keyboard shortcut for this. It's just the Windows key on the keyboard plus the side of the screen that you want the tab to be on. So. I can click bottom left, bottom right. This is really useful if obviously you need multiple tabs or applications running at once. You need to access them all quickly. And with this, you can have up to four right there in front of you. And the final tip I have today is something that us Windows users have been wanting for a while now. And we finally have it in Windows 10, and that is multiple desktops. So let's say you want to be multitasking, you want to have Twitter and Netflix open, and you also want to be using uh, or editing with Premiere and Audacity. Now you can open them all up on one desktop how I have them now, but when you do that it's easy to get mixed up and confused and it's just too many tabs going on at once. So what you can do, you can go over to the taskbar and you go ahead and click this task view button here. That brings up this little window and then you're going to want to click the new desktop button. This creates a new desktop here. If you go back and click the button again, you can go ahead and drag your editing apps over to that new desktop, desktop 2, and then desktop 1 you can leave the Twitter and Netflix. Now once they're separated, this just cleans things up a lot. If you want to go back to editing, you just click desktop 2. If you want to go back to Twitter and Netflix, you just go back to desktop 1. It just makes it much neater and less confusing and you can have as many desktops for as many applications as you want. So that about wraps it up. Those were my top three ways to increase productivity in Windows 10. Uh, I hope you guys enjoyed this. Maybe you learned something that could help you enjoy Windows 10 a little bit more. I know I'm really loving it so far. I think it's a great improvement. And anyways, if you like this video, please give me a thumbs up and subscribe for some more content coming soon. Thanks.